May 21st to 23. This video is about Actinidia arguta. That is the cold hardy kiwi. And it's grown up on the right side of this bamboo trellis here. On the left side, I've got honeysuckle. And they're kind of competing. But this is a female. And the Actinidia is also over here. And it is covered in little buds. You can see those there. And they are all over the place. If those are showing up in the camera, I think they are. At least uh, 50 or 60 on that one plant. That's a rough guesstimate. Then I've got another female over here. And this one is kind of competing with this rose bush. This rose bush was covered in, I think they were maybe spider mites, some kind of mite. If you can see the brown little things, brown little dots covering the new growth. But I hit them with insecticidal soap and that seems to have worked. And those same mites had also started to spread onto my kiwis. But same story here, just loads and loads of those buds. So this variety is Issa, I-S-S-A. And it's supposed to be self-hardy. I'm not hardy. It's supposed to be self-fertile. I know that um, having a male kiwi really helps. So I got a male kiwi. I got this two years ago. This thing has grown so quick. And it probably gets more sun than the two females. But this was a one gallon. And I'm pretty sure I put it in in 21. And it is now... If it was straight up, it would probably be 12 feet tall. I folded everything over to make kind of an, an arbor here. But this is not producing any flowers though. And I don't like that. So what I would like to do, I just built this little trellis thing here this winter. I would like to plant some over here on this side so that it would grow up and form a total arbor all the way over but I need to take some cuttings. I'm probably moving this summer, so man, it's getting so late in the year. I'm so far behind if I'm gonna move. Anyway, I gotta take some cuttings and propagate. Though I took a couple cuttings already and they were not successful, but I think maybe it was too early in the springtime. And this time when I take cuttings, I'm gonna use some rooting hormone, which I did not do the first time. But these are prolific and they grow quickly and they will just kind of take over if you let them and I like that a lot. The first year that I planted kiwis in 2020 I had a couple little bitty kiwi fruits. They were the size of not even grapes. They were very very small but they were delicious. It was a miniature kiwi. It was the coolest thing. So I really hope I get more fruit and I've got to get some good cuttings to take with me when I move. 